Hello students. This session is about understanding SPSS, how to use SPSS. So when you go to your start, you will find if the SPSS is already loaded, you will find it under IBM SPSS. So go to your that IBM SPSS and then you can initiate this IBM SPSS and you can I have uh, SPSS 21 so I am just uh, switching it on and it takes few seconds and it will be on. So this particular small window you can just close that. So you will see here that there are two different views. First is the data view, other is the variable view. Variable will, view will give you the information about the variables in the data the name of the variable, the type, the width, etc, etc. And the data view will have the data, first variable, second variable, third variable, right? And these are the observations or number of observations. So if you have 20 observations and 10 variables, you will have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 columns and 20 rows. And then menu has, uh, you know, Various options you have. Most of the times we will be using the options under analyze. And you will see here you have ANOVA here, one sample t test, and then you have correlation here, regression here, and all that. So, SPSS gives you uh, almost everything uh, which uh, you can you know use to analyze the data. Right. So, this was the initial session. Now, in the next session, we will we'll understand. The first chapter which is correlation and relation.